Scientists in Africa have stressed that large-scale adoption of hybrid rice will play an important role in tackling hunger and malnutrition crisis in the continent. I'm Nua Kogbanning, Director for Program Development and Commercialization at African Agriculture Technology Foundation. So the introduction of improved rice varieties will help ensure food security and reduce poverty. And the good thing there is that we are trying to use hybrid rice to improve farmers' economic status. And so if they grow this, they have enough food for themselves and then they can take the, the hybrid rice back to the market and then also make money. Okokbani made the remarks during a tour of the Mway irrigation scheme in central Kenya. Here, AATF has facilitated the introduction of hybrid rice to test its resilience in the face of extreme weather, invasion pests and diseases. According to Okokbani, hybrid rice in central Kenya has registered a doubling of yields. During the tour, Sheila Ochukbodu, executive director of the Alliance for Science, called on the adoption of hybrid rice to smallholder farmers. At the moment, we're very focused on supporting the work towards food security so that to help Kenyans feed themselves, to help farmers get access to information that would help them get the best seeds, best inputs, understand their soil and get the highest yields and make the best profit. She noted that hybrid rice is not only climate smart, but also rich in nutrients and ideal for tackling the malnutrition problem among children in Africa.